Hi there, this is Save Crypto. Okay, so pretty much ready for the uh, Zoid Pay auction now. Uh, what I did do is I um, claim some of the e-gold urn uh, in my MyR app just to make sure I've got a bit of uh, spare e-gold on the side in case I need it for any transactions. And uh, I can't connect my wallet yet because uh, it says coming soon. So I guess we wait four minutes. Okay, so 43 seconds to go. So let's see what happens. I'm going to log in with the MyR app, obviously, when I get the opportunity to, which should be in 31 seconds time. So a quick slurp of coffee. Now, do you think it'll be on time or not? I'm not sure. Okay, a bit more coffee. Okay, I'm ready. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one okay let's connect now i'm going to connect with the my art okay so how do i do this submit a bid below i'm just going to go maximum shopping pool name is going to be save with crypto okay bid sign transaction okay process bid transaction Okay, so at the moment, I'm there. Let's see who else comes in. Okay, number two's there, Power Wolf. I've got 277,491 Zoid Pay. Power Wolf has 107,367. So I need to be in the top 50. So I'm just looking here on um, the Zoid Pay USDC chart. I'm kind of expect to see some sort of movement with Zoid Pay, but at the moment, nothing. So I guess what will happen is everyone will get their bids in. You'll see who's got in the top 50. And then uh, people will try and sort of adjust their position by maybe getting hold of more Zoid Pay, which might change the price of Zoid Pay. be interesting to see anyway, wouldn't it? Okay, so that was a few hours ago. Um, Zoid Pay hasn't really moved at all. Um, E-Gold's been up and down a little bit. Um, it's quite strange, really, because, you know, quite a few things are... Kind of green today, not particularly green to be honest. Um, there's a few red ones, uh, but uh, and Zoid pays down there with with, uh, with those. So Zoid pays st uh, still about ten and a half cents. Uh, doesn't show much sign of uh, perking up to be honest. So I guess everybody who's trying to get a shopping pool at the moment has probably already bought their uh, Zoid pay. They've had it ready for a little while, and today they've just sort of. Uh, you know, committed it to get themselves on the leaderboard. And, uh, yeah, so it's uh, it's been running for, what's that, about sort of seven hours now. Uh, 19 bids received. Uh, I'm currently number two. Uh, number one is this European Secure Web3 Bank. And he's got 400,000 uh, Zoid pay. Very nice indeed. Um, but, yeah, and uh, so there's 19... 19 places and then I think the idea is uh, when when 50 places are full um, then it runs for another 72 hours um, and that's it but I don't actually know at the moment if there's any advantage in being number one or number two or anything like that um, or if you just you know you just you get a shopping pool and that's it so um, I guess there's a bit more fame at this point but nothing much really um, but if anyone knows anything different, please do let me know because I'd uh, I'd be interested to know. Um, I haven't got enough to get more than this guy here to get number one. So looks like I'm either going to be number two or less unless uh, somebody comes along with like a ton of money and uh, pushes me off completely. Could happen. I don't know. It's plenty of time to go. So we'll see. Actually, I did ask the question over on Telegram. And uh, I said, uh, does it make any difference where you finish or is it all good as long as you make the top 50? Uh, and th that was actually a, a question for Farim, who was one of the guys there. And Ahmed, who's also an admin in the Telegram group, um, he said, no, as long as you win a pool, you're good. So that's cool, isn't it? So I don't need to be number one. Okay, so it's looking likely that I might get one, which is brilliant. Yeah, people are saying, what if only 49 pools receive bids? Uh, will there be an auction at all? And will those that bid still get a pool, regardless if it goes to auction or not? 
I, I don't think there's a answer to that yet. Um, I wouldn't have thought so, to be honest, because you need 100,000 Zoid pay to have a certain status in the levels of Zoid pay. So I would have thought 100,000 Zoid pay would be the minimum. So uh, it looks like the people getting added now, due to call D5 franchise, commodity stake, uh, Z pay to the moon, um, these guys are all on the 100,000. So I think probably what will happen is, um, you know, there'll be a bit of a battle at the end between the hundred thousand people. Uh, I think that's what's gonna what's, that's what's gonna occur. And I suppose really, you know, if you're only talking like you know, nineteen people at the moment, that's why we're not seeing much movement on the price. But you know, to me, the whole Zoid Pay thing is a very, very, very cool thing. The only thing I don't like, I don't like the uh, card partnership they've got. It's a company called Fillet, and it's. Um, it's just horrible, really. So even the card doesn't look nice. Um, so I'm kind of hoping they do something themselves, or, or at least you know team up with a card supplier that is uh, a bit a bit nicer. Because I don't know the Zoid Pay thing. You have to pay for everything. You have to pay. You have to pay for a virtual card. Uh, you have to pay for an IBAN number. It's like you know just everything really. I hope that isn't to do with the. Bricks and mortar bank that Zoid Pay are supposed to be buying. I really hope it's nothing to do with Fillet. I, I really hope that is the case. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you can go to fillet.eu and you'll see this uh, this site here, which is all about the uh, the Fillet card. But you see what I mean? Even the card is like quite hideous. These are the people that Zoid Pay are working with at the moment, and I'm not a fan. Okay, so I was expecting to see some activity overnight, but there's still. Uh, 19 bids received and I'm still number two so that's all good to me um, the idea is yeah when it gets to 50 um, that will be it so uh, we'll see what happens then uh, but yeah meanwhile um, the price of Zoid pay hasn't moved in fact it's really quite cheap now it's like uh, 9.6 cents so the point is if you, if you did want to get involved with this and you know I strongly suggest you really seriously do do your own research um, you could actually get a hundred thousand Zoid pay for less than ten thousand dollars now, and uh, that means you could own a shopping pool. And the advantages of owning a shopping pool are many because within the Zoid pay system, the only place you can stake Zoid pay is in a shopping pool. And this is actually better than I think, better than the meta staking in MyR because MyR advertises up to 25 percent, but if you work it out, it's only usually about 11 or 12, so you can get. Uh, 12 or uh, or more with Zoid Pay, but if you've got a shopping pool, you get 15, so you get the special staking rewards. Uh, you get the income from the APY generated by your pool participants. So, for everyone staking your pool, you get like a I think it's 1% of what they get or something. It's not a huge, but it's uh, it's, it's good. Share of the cash back generated by the pool participants that's huge, isn't it? Uh, income by extending DeFi modules, including loans, and buy now, pay later. Now, I think this is going to uh, become more interesting in the next year or two um, because I believe the buy now, pay later um, trend is rapidly growing. Um, gamification benefits, that's to do with having a Zoidster and it increases your APY. I don't know a lot about that. I wish I could get interested in F NFTs, but they look so hideous that I, I just don't like them. And uh, the point being that only a thousand shopping pools will ever exist. There's currently 200. There's 50 in this auction, so that will be a quarter of them gone. So I don't know. I mean, to me, it seems like something worth doing, but uh, obviously don't put your life savings in there and do your own research and don't do anything because I'm doing it. Uh, but all I'm going to say is, uh, at the moment, the demand for the shopping pools isn't quite as big as I thought it would be. Uh, I thought they'd all be gone in the first hour, and then there'd be like a kind of battle to see who can get the most soy pay, but it doesn't appear to be like that. But it has been running less than 24 hours, so who knows. Uh, anyway, I think my position might be fairly safe, so uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing what happens and sharing the results with you guys. So if you're interested in that, um, please give the video a like. Um, try and share it with your friends if you can. Uh, and uh, leave a nice comment. And while you're down there, uh, give the video a like. Uh, make sure you're subscribed. Got the notifications set and all. And above all, tell your friends.